It's Thursday, campers. Almost there. First day sales of Activision's Blizzard's Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 broke records, raking in an estimated $310 million in North America and the United Kingdom alone. Intel Corporation is paying rival advanced micro devices $1.25 billion to squash a legal battle over Intel sale tactics. A rift led to antitrust charges against Intel in several countries. Walmart posted a 3.2% increase in third quarter profit helped by cost cutting measures like slashing inventories and raised its full year earnings outlook. United Technologies Corporation said today it will buy General Electric's fire detection and electronic security business for $1.82 billion in a deal to expand its similar operations in North America. And a drop in energy stocks dragged the market lower today following a government report that consumers and businesses cut back on their use of oil and gas. Here are the numbers. And British Airways PLC and Spanish Airlines Iberia SA confirmed they are holding separate board meetings today about a long-awaited merger, responding to fever speculation that has sent the company share soaring. And Lee Enterprises, publisher of the St. Louis Post-Dispatch and dozens of other newspapers, said it earned $1.76 million profit in the last quarter, helped by cost cuts and lower prices for paper. For the Business Press, I'm Dave Kaufman. Join us again tomorrow for another Biz Minute. <laughs>